Hey there, YouTube. This is Dan Strong with Excel VBA as fun. Today we had a quick question. A uh, gentleman told me he's got a user form with check boxes, one for each page that he's got going on. And what he'd like to do is um, be able to check whichever ones he wants and then click this print button and it'll print only the worksheets that he has checked. So let's review how to do that. We've got three sheets here. Sheet 1, Sheet 2, and Sheet 3. And let's make our user form, Alt F11. Let's go here and click on User Form. Now let's make our little check boxes. And you can make this look prettier all you want. But right now I'm just going to make it functional. Let's just rename this here Sheet 1, uh, Sheet 2, and Print Sheet 3. And um, it's probably best practice to go ahead and label these. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll call this uh, CBSH1. Hit, hit here and hit F4. CBSH2. Click here and hit F4. CBSH3. Um, now let's make our button. And uh, we'll rename this to print selected. Okay, so there's our button. That's where the code is going to be contained because it happens when you click on it. So let's do this. <clears throat> if me dot cb sheet one equals true, then um, me dot now let's do the, the the sheet here. This workbook dot sheets. And that was called sheet one. We don't have any fancy names for these. Uh, dot print out. Let's see here. And let's close this up here. And if. So the print out method. Let's see here copies I think that's right copies equals one so that should automatically print that um, we'll just, I'm just gonna copy this paste paste we'll change this to uh, sheet 2 and checkbox 2 and the checkbox 3 and sheet 3 and so whenever this button is clicked it's gonna go through here and say hey is this one checked or is it true well, if it's not, then I'll skip over that. And what about this one? Does this one need to be printed out? So let's see if I did the syntax right on the printout method, because it didn't give me any clues here to work with. Let's go ahead and hit F8. Uh, here's our user form. Let's do sheet 1 and sheet 3. I'm going to click the... Oops. No, no, no. I want to do... Um, I want to put the little stop marker here. There we go. Sheet 1 and th 3, print selected. Here's our stop marker. So is this checkbox for sheet one true? Yes, it is checked. So I have eight sheet one dot printout copies equals one. So that should send that one to the printer. Yeah, that worked. Okay, is sheet two checked? No, it equals false. So it skips over that one. What about sheet three? That one is true. So now it will send that one to the printer. Uh, whatever your default printer is, what the printout method uses and hit uh, F8 and you're finally done. So let's let's see that in real speed, okay? I just want to print out sheet 2 and sheet 1. And I'm going to click print selected. Boom. Oops. I don't know why this... Okay. Um, I'm going to hit F5 and let it continue now. Because uh, I guess whenever I was debugging through, I, the last thing I did was hit F8. Anyway, we're just going to let it fly through it now. Boom. Print that, print that and we're done. So that's how <clears throat> we use checkboxes to print out whichever worksheets that the user wants to use. Hopefully that helped you, Mr. Rich. Thanks for watching. God bless.